creeps. It is not gonna be any shenanigans. Two, two on two. Silence. Yeah. Where's the coming down? I have to look at some of the void positions. Okay, this is uh, blocking the small. Yeah, nice. Okay, lost. I'm getting uh, slapped across the face a few times. The Witch Doctor has a ton of region to uh, give to him. There's a problem. I want to see the uh, items that the uh, middle laners start off with. Okay, start off with Tango. Given that the Tango's cannot be pulled anymore, they just uh, expire in 40 seconds after being the real teammates. I uh, just wanted to see how they're approaching it. Just by Tango through themselves at this moment. Okay. Oh. One more. For now, it's just be a farm fest here. Dragon, uh, both Dragon and the creation do have some potential PL. Not that good at the top of heroes and pushing out a ton of damage. It will be a faster to do something, but it isn't gonna be enough to kill someone who can't have a not. Still on the other side, Dragon, if they uh, overcommit, something they could do. If uh, you want to go for kills with these two, uh, even from Rex's creation can be very, very strong, especially with an ask to play. Okay. He could be easy for now. The farming is not getting that many people to try to get the uh, main one, but it will get nice. Very nice to that way. Then, block here by the sentry ward on this uh, on the camp. It's actually increased the uh, yeah yeah for the camp. Easy trying to get that ward down. Will be successful in doing so. Dragon is not interested in uh, going for the block. What they block there? Second, uh, the attack can be used on the Phoenix, does have the fire, fire, as well as the dies. Phoenix probably can get the kill here, but they're trying to force out the dive on the Phoenix kill. He's not gonna be doing it, has the very far, has four magic stick charges. Chance to play here, forcing this out right now, leaving the Raid King alone under the top to farm as many creeps as he wants. Here comes the Raid King. Skeletons, are you fighting my Phoenix? Bam, bam, poked a little bit. Set task. Not gonna be hurting him enough. Met, just don't create versus the puck. For now, not doing that well. Actually, the source is solid against the puck because he has a ton of armor and the puck does like the harass. But uh, here, uh, he is up to them. The bottom lane are in some trouble. They need two more hits. Actually, will need just one more set. RR will get put into the ground. So, uh, Dragon, quite nice of They do uh, get electrocuted him put him into the ground for the electricity to come out of his body. So, Okay, saving him there, but in the end, just get a so, oh, Like I said, the puck in the mid lane, he understands he can't harass the storm, that's why he's uh, focusing on last hits, using his orb and his silence to make sure that the uh, little creeps go down. On the uh, bounty rooms, they're gonna be the three minutes. The storm will kill his one, but uh, be easy, bottle that one on top just to refill the bottle for Rico, who's now gonna be fine, just uh, trying to keep him healthy. Dragon again, they're starting off with the game. Yeah, the first one they had in game number one as well. Very important for them uh, to have a solid laning phase here. This creation didn't really pick that strong lanes, but for now, when it comes to the last, it's all three of them. As well, though, Dragon Core is not falling behind Dyer's much apart from the storm. You really outdo himself now. What the uh, rules gonna get going on? That's on the Shadow Shaman. The puck does get that water. <laughs> So turns around, gonna be doing a ton of damage and just dodge that there. So very nice is that by you uh, still turns around coming out from the storm. So much damage being done. Top lane are coming in. Actually, man, for the Fuduro situation, understand that the Malady is going to be mattering that much in the, in the lane and just wants to keep his PL help. A good is ready, but here we can't yeah, stop this itself. Second lane, so I'm getting done. It will have a tag in before he comes to Son of Arm. It's gonna be enough with the Phoenix coming in. It's not tough to defend the game. Now it's from PC. No, it might be a better choice, but PDC is easier to kill. Bottom lane, the Arm goes down to Ghost. And the Shadow Shaman one more time. But tomorrow's that fall protest is gonna be a one for one in the bottom lane. That's something that's missed. There was a ton of action happening in the So much action happening around the map. Phoenix, he doesn't have a time, which will be going down. One more hit from Yahoo. He is down, but he gets a turnaround kill. There's gonna be some ant in there. Some uh, way of Dragon getting something for themselves. Storm Spirit getting a nice kill for himself too. The Nico with the here on SS. That's the charges and the, uh, and the very far here is gonna be okay. Flakes execution, they get a few kills to their name, but, but uh, Dragon, of kills at least, 
still coming out of top. This mid lane though, uh, the fuck still continue to have a bit more than the storm, so he did kill some of the uh, wood creatures as well. So the difference is definitely there. The one. Connect there onto the tree. Gonna wait with the uh, god tribute. Do they know which one is real? Yes, they do, but can't do anything about it. He almost has the fuse chain drops. He has to be a key to help. Now the world is still in our lane. The bar is supposed to be still in our lane. Yes, he doesn't have any more control right now. He's not the storm coming and he's using the mana. He goes on the high cloak. He doesn't have the bottle. That's a level 1 mana. He can't get the kill. Rotation from the puck. Not gonna work. And he's good. Turn around. Coming up from the storm. Thinking about going for pay. Who does have a key? Could be in trouble. He has spotted the Ethernet of the area. That equipment will get uh, broken by the creeps, so damage will be done to the people here. The rotation from Dragon, they're still losing a little bit of effort. This puck is out himself in terms of farm, but that first rotation didn't work out that well. Usually, the teams that are actually on the uh, on the back foot, she's trying to put it a little bit to change something in the lane. Over here. Over here. Over here. Uh, we need the tower to the god tribute. He goes down so much damage being done. Now the whole thing is going to the sprint. Who doesn't have that much? Which means that he cannot pursue. Still jam. They had another kill for themselves. They're ramping up. The they definitely need to do this. Once this creation get a few more levels on their supports, they're going to be a tough to deal with. Most of them deny the seer. He won't be killing that. So Pelos hits level 6. Now Jax is ready. Most of them continue to be so progressive. Misses the spirit though. First seed will be break on the tower of storm spirit. Doesn't have mana or HP help that uh, get defended. This rating without uh, any added armor are from the phase loot. He cannot be close to us. Coming in with a snowball as it says, Travel Storm will take a look at my slowly. I've done a beautiful shard of immune as it says, Travel Storm is not there. They're getting called down and slow keeping it. He's gonna take his ult away and now that's more than it. Phoenix coming in to the Wish Doctor Cat. Gonna be bouncing, but not that well. No, I'm gonna miss. Now, on the go, they do get a turn on the dead. The one that you're gonna be liking more. Phoenix is in trouble. There's a Thanos on the bucket. Ziggy doesn't have it. Has an orb in three seconds. He's gonna try to use it. But a help. Keeping Phoenix might help. Not gonna be down. We goes for the drone. BDZ is there as well. They're not gonna be getting anything. Actually, it's gonna be a DD. He just picked it up so fast that they couldn't even see it. It is right now. The puck is going to fail. Um, apart from the puck in the Grimster, they don't have that much magic damage, so uh, that's a weird one. I would have expected to go for a flank or a Yule. Just quite much more sense if you ask me, but okay. Puck just wants to be dishing out the damage. Here we now go to top lane. As he says, could be in trouble. He's going into the woods where he will be met. Then he's checking the knees. Then he's and try to avoid who always is going to the afterlife. It's gonna be going to still the dragon on the bottom. They get it here. Carry hero for themselves as well. This uh yell a little bit worse than the uh uh than the rating so far, but overall a relatively even rate around map both fours going down. Secretion their movement was perfect, but uh Palos just not who uh that was or blind dragon are doing mid lane the phoenix approaching level six he's gonna be uh having fairly soon he's maxing out the sun ray only staying points on the uh, fire spirit quite apparently so the only one that attacks the egg that's fast is gonna be the pl and he can remove the fire spirits anyway so having sun ray is gonna be a lot the super is ready the task actually going for falcon blade it's not going to be a uh, a drums for him Shadow Shaman wants to eat the land. The item has been turned a little bit. Still, he goes right in front of him. Coming in for his attack. He does have a magic thing. If he wants to use it, the fire is going to be the fire. He's going to be the fire. He's going to be the fire. He's going to be the fire. He goes to the end. That's going to keep them in place. They're actually running away from him. That's what he's trying to get away. But not going to be happening. And they're killing him. They're coming in from the storm. Fuck. Think about going in. He's going to be the storm. He's going straight. Look at the discrepancy in net worth despite the storm they're having. He's not looking that well. Sans will be there. Things so get out of the storm. It comes a stroke of fate as well. He's really being annoyed here by Nico and this uh, grim stroke. Ton of damage. The bottle will get refilled. No, he made it up. Bit of a misplay coming out from Nico, so he won't be getting his extra mana 
right now. Going for the arcane boots into the max. So the Guardian Greaves are gonna be the item of choice for the offlaner of Grish. And this is something that I like. Usually, the uh, reason why these support can get weak is because uh, they are not tank enough. Right? But Nico, with the uh, on his uh, on its way, is gonna be quite powerful. Which Victor get six with the book. Now he has the death ward. Let's see if he can lack. When one, they don't have that much long down the shards. Gonna have to play any of the dragon. Where's Frank Dragon? Almost top lane. The stone has signs, but the PL is already leaping towards the mid lane. Just there to increase the uh, range towards uh, the top, which he is. That's why he spawned on top of that camp. It's gonna allow Continue farming the Halo Squad. Go for the Manta first, just for keeping the stats. He knows he's going to spawn in a very good game for Sharks. And then he makes a ball of stun to them. Now he's going to get into it, he's going to connect. No, it won't, but not even me. Mars even using the arena there to defend his feet. It will show a very uh, nice funeral there to the Phoenix. <laughs> Your guy going down. He used to be the uh, offlaner of the Dragon team now, transitioning to position 5. It's actually doing a solid job that position. So execution towards the top lane. See some sentries are gonna be fighting in division. They uh, do have some nice vision here but it's gonna expire fairly soon. It's done. This is a nice game. There. There's no call. Think about going in. As the veil of this court so Nico and Yo we do a ton of damage. Kano will be picked by the fucking ghost. He's just uh, flapping his shield around. That's not a toy, my friend. You uh, can hurt someone with that, but this time around he won't be hurting anyone. Again, high ground, two points in hex, two points in shackle. Definitely can lock down this spear long enough. Breaking. Yes, he's going for a radiance top all the way from the relic. Execution. They're done with this low pay. Radiant are scanning. We didn't talk about it. They're the ones that need to be ramping up the aggression in the mid game. For now, they're doing their job just to get away. As I said, he's point. expecting a gank, so he's spoiled right in the vicinity. He's not gonna allow this to happen, but we'll get to go. Yes, cool. Be some trouble. Beautiful usage of the spear there. We'll get the see away, even getting stunned by the snowball. But that's not gonna change the outcome and next game. They don't get anything out of it. Shards not connecting that well, being well being. And actually block out the path completely with the shards, but we see he just wants to use them perfectly and it's not gonna be doing anything. Mars now has the uh, the funds, so he isn't gonna be good of a target anymore. Most of the damage coming out from execration. Uh, most of the burst damage is magical, so that my team will hurt a lot. Get him up. Fate is tickling him at this point. I guess he's going down. Okay, excellent to the box. Finally, we're going to be seeing again. They're not going anywhere. Just be picked up, be smashed around, and then he just gets the kill. Man, I like it when he is. Uh, when the rating kicks up the face there. So, uh. No, I still don't understand why. Would you kick someone and look at your skeleton, spear leg? Which uh, PL is real the last time? Oh, it's gonna be beat out the team! Uh, the silence is there with the pool as well with the head. So no way for the PL to survive. In this mid game where execration should be the ones aggress going aggressively using their pool to get the kills and just pushing out the mid. This is looking really good for the Um I already I mean you can't say this is gonna be a uh, one move already because after uh, seeing 15 minutes of the game but dragon definitely in a much better Get 
about no, my life you is useless. Just take me away from the afterlife. It's gonna be a problem. Yo, we, I think he's regretting this video of Discord a little bit. Link only now coming out, but it might be too late. Dragon with the 4k gold lead, with their heroes positioning really well into the late game. They're gonna be quite happy with it. <laughs> Radiance almost done. Only a uh, done. That's about to stay on the 50 gold away, but he just killed three. Got it. As, as we'll have the radiance. The a little bit. The diffusal blade will be next. I don't know if you even go for the diffusal now, right? Um, the item Dyer's has been changed a little bit. We're gonna. We was doing really, really good after that, and he just wasn't the same. Dragon continued to play in the mid lane, not allowing their tower to fall, still allowing the uh, Raid King to farm. He's gonna be going for the KBS and Y next. Like the uh, hit promotion radius is gonna be enough to kill with the PL. I feel like we know she's gonna uh, Let it go. Go for, uh, go for Scotty, go for Heart. Radiant bottom tower. Look, if you go for the fusel, you're gonna be delaying timings on those next items. It seems to be the situation. In all events, the late Radiant game with the PL just popping off with the entire Where is the Phoenix Storm? He's not the best at dealing with the uh, with the VPFP. They're not the most timers. The power of the is not a game sound stuff. But as I said, with the Radiant, the first of the power from the side, you gotta go get it. You gotta go to the gun, you're fighting the crowd. And now, the summon will not be in a full music there. Dragon, they don't care. That says still gonna be staying in an aggressive position, farming the enemy agents. The kind of haunting execution with them with a little bit of my silence onto the fuck. Well, if you're a power, you have a will to visit. Well, for playing my bro, thank you for giving me a kill. Dragon out. Unstoppable thing on their store. Second play. Phoenix game. Oh, the Lulu's trying to get him, but he does have the pressure. And, uh, he yeah, does get him there. So, my bad guys, this is a young thing. Illusions, but in the end, the uh, master of illusion is gonna be prevailing there. There, so our oh, two fluffy hands. He uh, seems it's pretty cold. He's next to the tusk, so he may be sharing one with his, uh, with his team. RR? This is not looking good for uh, I, I just don't know what they do right now. Uh, when you have a Tusk, a Grimstroke in the offlane, and then you have a Witch Doctor, you need to be getting kills. This is what we do. Even if you're training, if, if you're dying, you need to be the first one jumping and just jumping it full on when it came, came to the uh, way they put in the mid game. You're probably like, oh, we can't do this. Oh, we're not sure if we can do this. Oh, maybe we're uh, be losing the fight and we're just questioning yourself like that. It's gonna end that pretty badly. Yeah, we're gonna be a Timing for application. If there's some time to fight, it's definitely right now. Waiting for the next item on the PL. We'll make sure the dragon just uh, takes the whole map. Have so many items. When it comes to the late game, you can fight the dragon. Are definitely on top. So, so for moments, that's a VKB. That's gonna make your world completely useless. You only know the yules. So, yeah, there's some trouble with storm traps on it. Won't get that one. Not from your wheel. Right there. Actually, you see the other one. Again, up, up, score. Breaking the blood, falling. Now, immediately, Pinkos coming in. With an EP, the only nice hour play of the storm there. And with that, Dragon will have to pay. They know that they can't do anything without their storm. In a 4 versus 5 scenario, Radiant could be just feeding an execration. Ill blood. And if you want to go in, BDC, what are you going to find? Looking left, right, left, right. Where are the heroes? Where are my targets? But for now, hunters won't be getting anything. So, I see those. Who has a blink there? Could blink to the left there. You need to go behind the tower if they want an action, but their smoke is already uh, gone. So, extraction. They can't catch anyone. 
sure you'll get the storm, but that was at your gear too, being the PL and They might be able to kill Payload. Still in the enemy triangle here. Execution. So this um, Payload's PL should be quite well. Breaking the only level 50. the strongest hero on the map at this point, but so many things to deal with. It's uh, actually the, uh, the rating does not have the BKB. Uh, you don't any longer, but still this Axshar will keep, change the game quite a lot. You can't burn this man anymore, so that uh, you will be able to be doing that much. It's going for a part, and then that will give you probably a little bit of damage, because you can see some people be able to get that one. Uh, coming to the end, he's a great space, he's a vision, this Shadow Shaman, but that's it by X, and he most likely use it, just to delay this, but again, he will be full of town, but wait for the uh, Link next, while well, top tower falls to the... Uh, so, a lot of things here being named two tier ones on the uh, opposing side. There's gonna be the Shadow Shaman falling side so, uh, this game 1, 2, and 2. Not really uh, something that we're used to from him. That have the uh, Mac Gold for the third. And this is there is almost a kick and beat. <laughs> If you had lost the two supports, it definitely would have been worth it for uh, execration. But still, they will lose three of their heroes in return and dragon. Happy with the exchange. The storm still working towards his BKB, but now in just a hundred gold, he's gonna have that. So these kind of turnarounds are not gonna be possible. <laughs> Radiant's bottom tower Sets. is under attack. What did he? Uh, he doesn't have the full sage. Oh, he's going to. Okay, he buys the Mithril Hammer, so the BKB is going to be his item of choice. That's the most to be, uh... That's the most to be there. The drum select, but the, uh, these are not greedy, doesn't need to be... Escape. Phantom Rush range is there for the field, he's level 20, but they're tier 2 on the bottom lane, he's falling down. He's going to get out, so he's going to go down. No, he's coming in, he still doesn't have the heart, but he's getting very, very close. He's just talking right now, and that's going to be giving him the final one. Dyer's top tower Dragon. is under attack. Coming to the uh, bottom lane. They're being out. Uh, the one bottom lane. Definitely the target for them. Even if they're losing the team on top. Sure. There's a... Uh, the is gonna be for the best thing to get. Going up against the PL before they get the BKB and the ulti back on the raid king. Would be uh, detrimental Dyer's for them. But that's... Will have it all be fairly soon. 
Bucker getting to the bottom of the lane. He's not being spotted just yet. Lincoln's almost done. Yoey, he uh, might not have a duel. He's going to be able to get to the bottom of the lane. He's going to jump on him right now. You don't have the duel. He's not worried. You're going to get to the bottom of the lane. And then the Bucker not taking that much damage. He's going to be able to get to the bottom of the lane. And the Bucker not taking that much damage. He needs to use the egg right now. He's going to survive. And he's going to be able to get to the bottom of the lane. Come out of this fight. Has been killed. It even got the Aegis help Storm Nine once in that fight. If the Aegis went to the PL, it would have been a disaster and did open up the spot for him, but no, he doesn't get it in the end. BDT now getting caught as well. Drag, they're gonna be going for more and no chance to snowball, which means that you can't even buy an extra three seconds for your team. Actually, so the Blink Dagger might have been able to get out. Fight for Dragon, it's just the same. The Thorn coming from the base without the TP, he could do it. And now he does have that level 3 TP, which he didn't have in the last fight. Making Dragon. Uh, very one big deal. Global type. In theory, this Christian BL has been a god in this game for a very long time, but he's not a god anymore. Going for another farm. What? What is the middle of farm for? Can someone explain beside it? Did, did they change the nullifier? No? Jewels for the Phoenix? That's a... That's the thing that you're buying it for? of a uh, silence there to think about it like maybe I'm stupid or something but uh, nope Wait, Kalos, just a wind item choice coming out from him it is a very strong damage item but other than that it really doesn't provide anything in this game and now it's all being used Strong 
on his own. Has the FN wall, has the Titan Slimmer. So, so much status resistance on the status as thinking. It is just not an easy target for the PL. Can I feel the monkey are for payloads? Definitely a better choice to uh, deal with this. Uh, deal with this. It's not gonna be there. Are they going for smoke? They want to fight right now, but there's no way. There is a arena ready. Dragon, they're fighting for so long that their spells are always gonna be coming back. Absolutely big cooldown. They actually have. It's gonna be the. Uh, it doesn't really matter if it pops once. They're gonna be happy with it. It's crazy. Radiant are scanning. Toward bottom lane now they finally have the Lincolns it's gonna allow you to survive some of these fights and the next time will be an axe so scratch and I never you really good I tried it the uh little like it kinda but the main thing is gonna be kill the storm get out kill the storm get out that's what you approach this game and the king right now you need to leave him for, for last even if you do that it's that easy bringing the king down. He's been farming for the majority of the game. Still not being able to uh, go with the uh, what? Okay, she is ready. So cute. We're gonna be double invents right now. That's how much these guys want to fight. So much that they're gonna be spamming their uh, smokes. Just kidding. That's a little bit of a miscommunication, but it doesn't matter. The dragon are ready to show us some blood. We standing there, he does have a little spear, so not that easy to catch, but so many things on the side of Dragon to climb up. If he gets hit by a spear, he's just gone. Yo, doesn't have a does have a buyback. Oh actually he doesn't have a buyback for 50 gold, but yo, that's a bit fairly cool. To see him here, he's willing to get the old brain. Okay, we already go to the sun and links out. He's gonna use the ulti, but oh no, shadow shaman if he can't finish him out. He's gonna have to use the ulti and he's gonna accept his destiny. He's like the rest of them will accept his destiny as well. They use two smokes for him and they don't accomplish anything. Dragon is losing their uh, for now. Running away against the video, he's like, he's gonna be getting the game. 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 He's gonna be that his ring does even more damage on Dragon Air that's way too strong right now. Attack. Yo, might Shadow Shaman, he can buy back into the fight if needed. Now Dragon approaching with a lot of confidence. Look at how he's walking, not looking back, just looking to this tier 3 tower. I want you next, like all of your heroes. And I'm going for the tower, but the didn't win. It wasn't on the back line, but being caught, Storm traps it. So much damage being done by that zip, and he had just enough mana to deal. Uh, that puck and deal all of the damage. The buyback has his, but the heal is nowhere close. Having his puck back and the bounty is picked up. It's gonna be impossible. There's nothing they can do about it. Yeah, tower, there's no good. The five minutes, but the buyback is impossible. Using the racks, but it doesn't seem like yes. Stop. Value being used. He can't even kill it once a day. Definitely can't. Oh my god. Is gonna be pretty big. Uh, you can't use any spells on them. That 
and uh, he's on the side of the uh, station. He's gonna be quite big. Let's see how much he can actually do. Because he's raiding, always got his uh, radiant off when he's pushing. He doesn't want to uh, to give that one. Radiant middle he's most likely gonna have the arc looking against the PL. Seventy percent reduction. Basically, that's something that you need. The PL is a mind rip, mind breaker. It's the uh, Definitely the best item for him, and he's going for an next item. So, uh, that's not the Blood Thorn Nullifier that used to be. That used to be. So, it's not sure what the what fails to be. Kali, Battlefly, those kind of items, they made sense. Not gonna be wrong for them. The Red King now has some Mjolnir, another way to deal with illusions. I don't know. Is he regretting his item choices? He shouldn't be beating him. Well done. He shackles and brought down. It's gonna be a 4 versus 5 underneath the uh, Serpent Force last time around. The vehicle was able to deliver this. I think he's just gonna punch him back out of the Here comes the orb. You're gonna see the drone is falling quite low. There is an extra threat for it. Is he getting it? No. He knows the drone is falling against him. And that's what we're going to do. He doesn't get the egg. That's what we're going to get. That's what we're going to do. But then we're going to pull up on the shadow. We're going to get on the side. So the vehicle here to get just this man. That's what we're going to do. Exclamation. Just, uh, just getting an island. <laughs> yeah, getting brought uh, from a hundred loose zero with the uh, with the lockdown on the side of dragon. This is looking like a GS task again. Let's see if that portrait doesn't change anything. Uh, I guess the cookie doesn't like the painter six. It's come out, portrait come out, still gonna be somewhat unfair. Having a Maybe I would like to see a blink dagger more, but if you blink, you're actually just committing.